Before this video starts guys, I just wanted to mention that I'm doing a 1BGL giveaway every single video. All you guys gotta do to enter is like the video, subscribe and turn on post notification bells, comment your girl ID and your world. There will be two winners, 50 diamond locks each, and as simple as that. Also, I stream on the Twitch platform daily, so make sure to come tune in and show love, and I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Peace. What's good boys, Sleazy back. If you guys do remember last video, we went crazy on harvesting saber trees. We lost no world logs because of how much profit we made that video. But in today's video, what we're gonna do is showcase the most cursed items in Grotopia. As always, if you guys have been enjoying the content, make sure to smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, and let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Without further ado, let's get right into the video. All right, boys, we are are here and we have the amazing items right in front of us okay so the first one as you guys can see right over here is the greedy pickaxe and then right over here we have the Thanos hand these items are so powerful that you're kind of gonna lose your mind I haven't checked them myself you know usually every single video before we start I don't check the updates myself so I could actually see exactly what's gonna you know what we're gonna see together so Let's start off with the greedy pickaxe first and see what this item holds, okay? So, a greedy pickaxe. Okay, the effect isn't, okay, the effect isn't that crazy or nothing like that. Let's see if I break a block, let's see how it looks. So if I were to break a block, okay, not bad, not bad. Something slight, something slight. So, greed for everything will make you lose everything. Damn. <laughs> okay, Shakespeare with the goddamn description, not gonna lie, man, damn. All right, let's see the extra drops. Oh my, oh my, oh my god, oh my god, hello? Cashback coupon 10,000, 50,000, 100,000, and the normal cashback coupons? Oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm gonna have a good time in today's video, not gonna lie, this is gonna be too lit. What we're gonna do is, we're gonna take this and put this baby to the test, okay? I'm gonna head over to a dirt farm real quick, we're gonna go break a dirt farm, see how it does, and then we'll switch over to actually breaking with this in a BFG form, so... Let's go, boys. Alrighty, boys. We have made it to the dirt farm, and let's start using this pickaxe. Okay, I got a few gems. Hopefully, I get one of those cool-ass gem vouchers. We're just going to start off like this, you know, see how de devious this item is in a normal world, and then um, we'll continue on to a little BFG, see how devious this item is in a BFG, but um, it's looking like I'm getting literally nothing right now. I'll never mistake the way you give me my faith. My body feels safe in your hands. Feel me fully faith. I'm right as a fire that I'm not in your
right, boys. We got nothing. I'm pissed. Literally pissed. I'm not surprised because it is a rarity uh, that is low for a block. It's one rarity, right, for each dirt. So I'm not really, you know, surprised. But I thought we would have gotten at least one decent, like one 10,000 gem voucher. But no, no, dirt worlds. I guess you got a, there's a smaller uh, drop chance. So let's switch over to a BFG with higher rarity blocks. And let's see how much we can get from that compared to what we got from the dirt farm. Let's go, boys. Alright boys, after farming we actually got a couple of decent drops. We got a 50,000 gem cashback coupon and a normal cashback coupon. So if we use this, that gives us, you know, a random amount of gems. But this will definitely give us 50,000 gems. And that was only us farming for like 10 minutes, 12 minutes at tops. And I put it up in speed up mode. But that is a lot of gems for farming for literally 10 minutes so imagine if i farmed for a full hour i would literally be stacked didn't get a lot from the dirt farm but we got a lot from normally farming from rare blocks so now let's move on to the thanos hand i will speed it up and i will only do a bfg because i don't want to break a full dirt farm like before so if we take off the greedy pickaxe and take a peek at the amazing thanos hand let's put it on Okay, okay, this is pretty fire. Oh, dang, and it's three far. Good job. But it is three far, and I'm pretty sure it's one hit, so that is actually awesome as heck as well. So, let's look at the info on this. At the start of the Infinity Gauntlet, the character Thanos has collected all six Infinity Gems and attached them to his gauntlet. With their combined power, he becomes like a god and sets out to win the affection of Mistress Death, the living embodiment of death in the Marvel Universe, only available in the shop due to its overpower. Okay, okay, let's look at the extra drops. Um, oh. oh my, oh my gosh, oh, I, I don't even wanna talk anymore. We're gonna, we're gonna go head over to a BFG right now. Let's go check this out, boys.
fun we got tons of gems and we made a bit of profit the thing is with the greedy pickaxe we got the special drops but with the Thanos sand it is a very very rare item I didn't expect us to get a crazy amount of special drops but we got a crazy amount of gems I forgot to mention that Thanos sand is 50 times gems as well so that's why we got the amount of gems we got which was also cool um what do you guys think is better, the Thanos Sand or the Greedy Pickaxe? The Thanos Sand also has 50, uh, 50 times gems, but the Greedy Pickaxe provides gems. So, you guys let me know down in the comments. You guys are amazing. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe button, and as always, stay awesome, stay sleazy, and I'll catch you beautiful people in the next one.